Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at a TriStar 12 gauge shotgun called the Cobra 3 Marine. Check out that finish. That's why it's called the Marine model. It's got this heavy coating that not only looks good, but is very resistant to the elements. We hear so often that shotgun barrels begin pitting over time or uh, they take them into a, a moist environment and people have problems, won't happen with this because it, it's got that coating on there that I, I think looks outstanding. It has a couple other things that I wanna go through because it's got an MSRP of 305 and this is a lot of shotgun for the money. It's got about three quarter inch recoil pad, polymer stock, polymer forehead with a pick rail, bladed up front sight. It does have a cylinder bore choke, so it is threaded, so other chokes could be added. And then the magazine tube holds five rounds and I've got six loaded right now but there's something else I want to show you that I've never seen before but I'm going to shoot these and we'll talk about that did you notice anything different it has a spring loaded forend check this out Yep, unloaded. So, the idea of short stroking this shotgun will not happen because it's got a spring in there. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see that. But all you do is move the action and it will spring load right back into place. Now, I have to admit, I have short stroked some pump action shotguns in the past. You have too. <laughs> if you shot enough, then I know you have. And uh, this will prevent that. It's got a chrome lined barrel and chamber. And I think I mentioned the MSRP is 305. And I think that's a lot of shotgun for the money. It's got an 18 and a half inch barrel. So it's uh, small enough, but yet, you know, it, it, it's a nice shotgun so far. I'm, I'm really digging it. And I think it really looks cool. Let's load it up. All right, so I have five shells in the magazine tube without one in the chamber. Here's Fiocchi seven and a half shot, high velocity. So it's a much more powerful load than what you just saw. But I wanna further demonstrate the fore end. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to rack it back and then let go. First shot, we'll go right in the middle. All right. <laughs> just like that. And that's it. What do you think? Have you ever seen anything like that? It's got a nice, I mean, I think that's a pretty cool feature. Now, if you don't like that, you can take that spring out and you can manually work the fore end as most other shotguns are, so, or, or offer. So that's, uh, that's pretty cool. But it's got a, a kind of tactical look to it with that marine coating and the black accents along with the way the trigger looks. It's got the forend release right there, all right? And it's a TriStar. But every time I do a shotgun review, somebody says, how come you didn't put slugs in that? How come we didn't see you shoot slugs? How do we know to accept slugs? Well, I've got slugs, so let me load up those slugs. All right, so here are three inch, one and a quarter ounce slugs. I have four loaded up in the Cobra 3. I'm going to shoot at that center tombstone only. My targets are phenomenal. CTS targets, I love them, but I want to keep them. They've with, withstood everything that I've ever fired at them, but in this case, I'm only going to use that tombstone. Wow! Am I hitting it? There. Oh, well, those were four slugs, and man, did that punch back. I'm thankful for the heavy recoil pad, but I'm also feeling that because it's a light shotgun. 6.2, 6 pounds, 2 ounces would be the way to say it. 
and I'm pretty happy, pretty happy with it. 100% reliable so far with target loads, high velocity loads, and now slugs. Here are three more three inch slugs. I'm gonna load it up and show you the recoil in slow motion. So you can be impressed not only by the shotgun, but by the reviewer. You're gonna say, this guy is one manly man. Are you ready? Here we go, I'm back up a little bit. I just watched the shooting on my viewfinder and did you notice on that third one that it did chamber with the help of the spring loading? That's a good example of what could happen because it was a three inch shell. It got caught up just a little bit. I think in many other cases with other shotguns, it may not have fully chambered, but that time it did and I was happy with the way that turned out. So there it is, TriStar Cobra 3 Marine model. There's a look at the loading gate. Also has a cross bolt safety, but it works great. And I do look forward to doing more with this, especially uh, some of the shotgun spreads with some of the various chokes. But a nice setup and I'm really happy with it. Oh, and by the way, the chokes are Beretta Benelli chokes. So if you have those already, or they're easy to find, you can throw those chokes in there, get a little tighter spread if that's what you want. But I plan to do more with this. It's a, it's a nice shooting shotgun. It performed well, and I certainly think it looks beautiful. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching, and you guys be safe.